Hi, this is Rockin' Robin. Today we're in Stewart, Florida at the Sailfish Splash Water Park. When you first go in, you're gonna have to stand in line and get your tickets. But once you get your tickets, you get a wristband like this that you can use for the entire day. And then you enter. And the first thing you see when you enter are the pools where you can just do lap swimming. Sometimes they have programs going on and people are practicing their routines. There are also big diving boards. But most people buy the tickets, head into the water park. are several small slides and water features for the young ones. There are lockers available to put your items in. You get that at the gift shop and then they'll refund your money once you give them the key back. Once you decide you wanna put your towel down and find a spot, there are several different types of resting areas for you. Let's check them out. The cabanas cost extra money and you will pay that when you come in. Some are just basic and others are a little more fancy like this private cabana. Let's see what's in there. This one even has a fan to keep you cool. Now it's time to start the water park. And you might want to start off with some of the water slides. Wow, look at all the people up there. Well, you, can, you must be over 42 inches to go on it. So if you're a child, it must be that large, but then you can go up to the top of this slide if you can walk and you can come down two different ways. I will show you both. If you are looking for something a little calmer, just go to the right and you will find the Lazy River. You will see people in tubes floating in and out of them. Most of the ride is very calm and peaceful, but there are a few water features that can definitely get you wet. In the summer, the water park is open from 10.30 a.m. to 5 p.m. The Lazy River is 1,000 feet long. Thank you. 
There are always lifeguards on duty in all parts of the water park. Season passes and swimming lessons are also available. Occasionally the park will have splash and movie nights. Go to their website to see and get your tickets. Once you've had your fill of the water, don't forget to stop by and get a quick bite at the refreshment stand. It's called the Splash Cafe. And then stop by the gift shop before you head out. This is Rockin' Robin. Thank you so much for watching. Please remember to subscribe, watch all our videos on Florida, and give us a like. Thank you. Have a great day.